just finished up Hal Corner's Field Guide to Ultra Running. I find it to be a very informative book. I definitely recommend it. It touches on a lot of different topics. If you're beginning in the ultra running uh, scene, you're definitely going to want to listen to this book. I'm going to tell you right now, I'd say listen to it more than read it because I think you'd pick it up a lot better listening to it than trying to read through some of the stuff. At least from my perspective, that's how I feel about it after listening to it. He touches on pretty much all the basics uh, that you're going to need to know for uh, prepping for an ultra. You know, such as elevation training, uh, you know, how to get acclimated, uh, first aid, you know, popping blisters, little injuries like that, nutrition, hydration, uh, shoes, clothes, socks, little things like that that most seasoned ultra runners have dialed in but maybe a beginner doesn't really think about or have dialed in yet so this gives you a basic understanding of how to choose or how to train and prep and even goes into pace a little bit on race day and how to train for an ultra doing you know like fart legs or uh, hill repeats even says about technique on how to run downhill how to run uphill uh, poles if you're going to use trekking poles during race there's a lot of variables if you're an ultra runner that you know you run into like no race no two races are the same even if you ran the same race 10 years in a row it's going to be a different race every year because of conditions um, you know whether it be hot cold rainy snowy whatever the case may be that's just on stuff like that and a little bit of his background and his experience in ultra running and during races it gives you a lot of good information again it's the basics because a lot of information that you get in ultra running or stuff that you need to know you really have to tweak yourself such as nutrition food wise everybody when you run a long distance uh, your body's going to crave different things or need different things so he can't give you a, a 10 hour uh, lecture on hey this is what you need to do what you need to eat and so forth at uh, certain intervals because everybody's different but he does touch <clears throat> on the basics hey you know maybe drink something every like 20 30 minutes uh, get some uh, make sure you're taking enough calories how much the calories um, your body can burn in an hour little things like that that get you thinking and prepping and training to understand what your body needs what your body's doing uh, I guess yeah giving you the basics to prep train prepare and actually race an ultra I'm not saying after reading this book you're gonna go from a 5k to a hundred mile race but it's just taking that next step if somebody's we'll say doing a a marathon they want to take that next step into the ultra this is a very good book it'll give you the basics how to do things and understand things and how to get your mind uh, ready on race day you know not going out too fast going out too hard and then blowing up and having a bad race um, or getting behind on nutrition or not taking care of a hot spot on your foot you know making sure you have proper shoe care um, footwear and again like socks and proper clothing just little things like that again because it's a field guide for ultra running I, I almost want to put in basic field guide to ultra running in the title because I feel like that's what it is again because in ultra running you get a basic knowledge whether it be from this book another book from people in general and then you have to build off of that with your own um, experience and knowledge and things that you tweak to make you uh, cross that finish line so if you get a chance listen to this book again listen to it and not read it because you I think you'll retain and understand things a lot more uh, if you listen to it then read it 
Let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed it. It did cover a lot of things I already knew. There was a couple things I did pick up. And it, um, the things I already knew, it just, I guess what you could say is it reassured me that I was doing things the right way and I'm not the only one doing things a certain way because I tend to do what I consider weird things because other people in my area don't do what I do. So seeing, well, listening to him talk about it just reassured me that I'm not the only one that does that or thinks about this or that. Um, he even talks about a little bit about uh, going to the bathroom on a trail, you know, stepping off the trail um, so nobody sees you, not leaving any trace. So, like, like toilet paper, you know, make sure you're uh, digging a hole out and then you're actually uh, getting back on the trail where you stepped off and you're not advancing. Um, just little things like that. You know that's in the book so hope you like it check it out and i definitely recommend it